Orcas, also known as killer whales, have a reputation as the ultimate hunters of the ocean. These apex predators are known for their recognizable black and white coloring, tall dorsal fins, and remarkable intelligence. Let us delve into their hunting tactics and examine their ability to kill even the great white sharks. Orcas belong to the dolphin family and grow up to 30 feet long, weighing over 5 tons. Some studies suggest that they have complex social structures and may even use their own language. Orcas have been observed using cooperative hunting strategies, demonstrating their exceptional problem-solving skills. They are also one of the few species known to attack and kill great white shark. The name killer whale originates from their reputation as hunters of other whales. Each hunt is carefully planned out according to the prey they will be pursuing. Every hunting party has evolved its own distinct hunting methods and they can range in size from 5 to 30 members. Orcas approach various species of their prey in various ways. To make a shark easier to catch and kill, orcas adopt techniques to confuse the shark. Similar to this, orcas that are pursuing a school of tiny fish may emit a lot of air bubbles, which confuses and disorients the fish and makes it easier for the orcas to catch their meal. The orcas kill whales employing a harsh a successful technique that involves ramming, biting, and tugging the whale with their pectoral fins in order to overpower the victim and end the hunt successfully. Even though the target is significantly larger than the orcas, they usually overcome it due to their hunting techniques. The orcas also attempt to drown their prey. Orcas are renowned for their complex social structure. They cooperate to locate food and safeguard their young and live in close-knit pods. The effectiveness of their hunting strategies depends on their social ties. For instance, orcas employ coordinated strategies to confound and overwhelm great white sharks by utilizing the strength and expertise of every individual in the pod. In order to preserve these talents from generation to generation, the mother orcas also teach their young their hunting methods and tactics. Orcas are not only known for killing prey that is smaller than themselves. In fact, there have been documented cases of orcas successfully hunting blue whales, which may weigh more than 190 tons. Orcas are notoriously vicious predators who prey on young whales and humpback whale calves. They will typically only consume the tongue of these calves, leaving the remainder of the carcass for other animals. In addition, they are known to kill sharks. However, the only part of the shark that they take is its liver, since it contains a high concentration of vitamins. Orcas have been observed to kill and consume moose, which is a really peculiar behavior on their part. Orcas are known to hunt animals that are outside of their traditional range of prey, which may seem strange to some people. But this behavior has been observed and documented. Orcas are a genuinely fearsome adversary in the sea because of their extraordinary prowess as hunters, their capacity for social cooperation, and their level of intelligence. But. Is there anything that could be able to compete against such terrifying hunters? The answer to that question is yes, which could come as a surprise to you. The sperm whale is the only animal that could kill the orca. These enormous whales may weigh as much as 90 tons at their heaviest. Orcas will only prey on the females and young calves of sperm whales and even then, it is an extremely uncommon event. This is probably owing to the enormous size and strength of adult sperm whales, as well as their superior intellect and ability to work together, all of which make them challenging prey for orcas. It is common knowledge that orcas are capable of taking down even the dreaded great white shark, which is one of the largest predatory fish found in the ocean.
Orcas are the sole natural predators of great white sharks and are capable of killing them thanks to their exceptional hunting abilities, high intellect, and the fact that they work together in pods to bring down their prey. It has been observed that the orcas work together to confuse and defeat the great white shark. They do this by depending on the power and knowledge of each individual member of the pod to accomplish their mission. Geography plays a crucial role in orca great white shark encounters. Orcas are found in all oceans and most seas, with the highest densities in the Northeast Atlantic and the North Pacific, while grey white sharks are found in almost all coastal and offshore waters with water temperature between 12 and 24 degrees Celsius. Both species have their preferred areas of distribution, with orcas generally impacting great white shark distribution negatively. For example, orcas were recorded to have killed great white sharks of South Australia and South Africa. The scent of a slain shark's carcass has caused all the great whites in a region to flee, which is thought to be an example of either competitive exclusion or ecology of fear. However, some great whites have been observed swimming close to orcas without fear. The distribution of these species affects their likelihood of encountering one another and can influence the outcome of these interactions. Encounters between orcas and humans have been relatively uncommon, but the stigma of orcas as killers has lingered in Western cultures. Despite this, there have been instances of orcas exhibiting aggressive behavior towards humans, particularly in captive situations. However, in the wild, orcas generally do not pose a threat to humans and there have been a few recorded incidents of wild orcas attacking humans. Till it come, a bull orca held captive at SeaWorld was implicated in the fatalities of three individuals between 1991 and 2010. The documentary film Black Fish shed light on Titicum's story and brought attention to the issue of captive orcas displaying aggressive behavior, which is believed to be a result of the stress they endure in captivity compounded by their intelligence and size. Grey white sharks have been responsible for the most number of shark bites on humans, with 272 unprovoked incidents recorded by 2012. Despite its reputation as a man-eater, largely due to the book Jaws and his film adaptation, grey white sharks do not generally target humans. Most bites are a result of the shark mistaking a human for his preferred prey. As humans have a high ratio of bone to muscle and fat, it is believed that this mistaken identity may be caused by the shark's color blindness and poor ability to see fine details. Orcas are often regarded as one of the most spectacular and incredible species found anywhere in the animal kingdom. They are well known for their high level of intelligence as well as their capacity to communicate, hunt, and work together within their pod. They have great swimming abilities and a varied diet, consisting of a wide variety of foods, ranging from fish and seals to even larger whales. Orcas are well known for their acrobatic abilities since they frequently breach the water's surface and slap their tails against it. Orcas are a genuinely exceptional and awe-inspiring species due to their stunning appearance, incredible strength, and fascinating behavior. If you enjoyed this video, you may also like our video on the topic, Why are orcas called killer whales? Thanks for watching and have a nice day.